corporations are using video to communicate with their entire culture of their, their company that way. CEOs of, of major companies are leveraging it like we would leverage it to sell houses. Wait till you see this place. Check this out. Check this out. It has waves, like you hear the waves crashing, like they're right here, which technically they are right here, but the view, the view. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> it is that amazing though. Let me show you the room because come on, we have this great balcony. It's like a house. This isn't even a room. This is a full kitchen. I really feel like I need to host now because man. So yes, welcome to my humble abode for the couple of days. Thank you, Vista Sotheby's for putting me up in an amazing place. But look at the view, you guys. I have to say a little bit of nervousness. It's been a couple years in all fairness. You, you know, it's always that practice, but I'm here because let's face it, video has not only impacted my life, but if you're a consumer and you've been in the market to buy real estate over the last year and a half, video is kind of the only way you were gonna get into houses. And so we never skipped a beat. I think it's almost expected now for not just sellers, but even buyers to have that in terms of when they're looking at a house. But this is why I need to share it with all my people. The people that inspire me to be great, I wanna make sure that they have the nuggets and the tips and the tricks. So the way I get over my nervousness is not making it about me and making it all about them. And how much can I share with them in a quick one hour session that's just gonna help them sell one more house, impact one more person, but most importantly, it's about paying it forward because this is an amazing rock star group of individuals. It is a jam packed couple of days. I've got more to show you. I finally arrived, I feel. Just doing a little test run here, making sure that everyone, everything works. Hey, Gamera Anderson. Okay. Hey. Done, and... Okay, hey, Gamera. Okay, there's the arrow moving, yes. Oh man, I'm gonna be looking up though. All set. But think of if you, any industry, you're gonna Google, whether it's the best painter, the best mm -hmm. hairstylist, whatever that might be, and you're looking for a video. I mean, mm -hmm. I think that's just the standard, the norm, and, right. and then you're going to watch the video and hope that it's a good video and hope that you actually have some rapport, and if not, you move on. But I think the expectation now is, and it's not just small businesses. I mean, we're talking corporations are using video to communicate with their entire culture of their, their company that way. Huge CEOs of, of major companies are leveraging it like we would leverage it to sell houses. So. Right, right. Because, I mean, the overarching theme that we see is that video creates emotion. Emotion is going to create those buying decisions and people who are buying and selling property. And logic is going to justify that emotional response, really. It, yeah. it doesn't matter if it's the most powerful CEO in the world or if it's you know, somebody who you know, works a traditional nine to five. It's that emotion that, that creates in those it's people. It's the connection. It, it's, I mean, people yeah. do business with who they like mm -hmm. and that's really what it's all about. Video gives you that instant rapport that, right. and just an opportunity to see if it's somebody you do want to work with. For that exactly. Matter. Exactly. It allows it allows kind of that understanding of, of who that individual is. Yeah, connection is huge. So I'm here because I've been in the trenches for 10 years mastering how to leverage video in real estate, but most importantly, 
I get to share with my peers and they get to take away all of our tips and, and all the, the hours and hours that I've spent practicing and learning all the things. Um, they get it packaged up and hopefully they're, not hopefully, I'm super excited because so many people are coming back for a second, a third time and I've tried to level up my game and my presentation just to make it new. Think, think of it as the, it's Amber is going to provide the source code. The source code, like when you, if you remember the movie The Matrix, the source code, the, the ones and zeros. Oh, Mr. It. Anderson. Huh? Miss, miss, well, Mrs. <laughs> Anderson, yes. Um, but yeah, so she's going to give you the cheat code to to understand how to do it. And it's it's that shortcut that everybody wishes they had. And, you know, the tens of, I mean, we're probably in, I don't even know how much at this point, learning the hard way. And sometimes that's the best way to learn. But in this case, I mean, you don't want to be trying to figure it out for 10 years because in 10 years, we might be completely virtual and there may not even be an opportunity to walk into a house. So I think we're, we're on a different trajectory and video is... Video is now video. I think buyers, if they don't have to go into a house, if they feel like it's their responsibility to either look at the 3D tour or look at the video for sure. So agents that are, are not doing that as a just a standard practice when it comes to selling houses, I think are, are really missing out because things have changed and, and both the seller appreciates it because they have less bodies coming and touching everything in their house. And I think the buyers really appreciate it because they don't have to waste their time if they truly, truly don't connect with the property. So it, it, yeah, it functions as a kind of a preemptive screen screening tool. It could be really funny when we go to the room and he picks up the phone and they say, hello, Mr. Anderson. No, that's not really funny. I checked in and it was Mr. White. But <laughs> oh, see, I was on that I'm, one. I, I, could I tell, was on that one. I could tell a lot of jokes, but I'm afraid uh, they just wouldn't be appropriate for redistribution. Which one? <laughs> all, all of them. <laughs> all of them, yes. Oh, what was it? That's it. No. Yeah, we're real good, real good. I've seen her hold a ladle, and somebody's like, I want that ladle in that kitchen for that price, and they sold the home. It's incredible, yeah. it's amazing. amazing. Amber Anderson, happens on the daily. So I'm going on in that first room that you passed. Okay, okay. so that's good just have everything at like 15 two. Perfect. Yes. I mean, I have clients now that are like, have they call for a showing, have they watched the video? And if they haven't seen the video, they're not getting in for a showing. It's one extra way that you can see the house, you get the emotion, and that's why you can't skip that step anymore. It allows people to get to know me without ever meeting me. I can be sleeping and people watch my videos. Do we have rapport? Do they like me? Do they not like me? I don't care, they have an opportunity to get to know me and when I look at how many hours of videos are being watched on my YouTube channel every month, it's fascinating to me because I'm just like, when? It really does satisfy the need um, for what buyers are looking for, but most importantly, the biggest mistake that agents can make are not being in their videos. And, and that's the part where, again, you're standing out, you're having that connection, people are deciding who they want to go with. So, if everybody is so big on video and you know you need to do it, then it's like, why don't you? Hey, hey! Come on in. It's been two years, you guys, since we've been anywhere. And wow, this is just something that, no, I need to redo that. So how do I prep? Might do a little bit of jump in, get my energy up. You're gonna wanna come up to LA. Just kidding, San Diego and stay in San Diego. Just kidding. <laughs> Hey, hey, thank you so much for making it to the end of this video. If you like what you saw today, be sure to hit that like and subscribe and that bell button. Of course, we've got a great recommendation over here. And of course, be sure to check out this video too. But more than anything, thank you so much for your support. Ciao, ciao for now, and we'll see you soon.